Club foot is a deformity in which an infant's foot is turned inward, often so severely that the bottom of the foot faces sideways or even upward. One infant in every thousand live beds will have club foot. 80% of all club foot cases occur in low middle income countries, including Ghana, with only 15% having access to treatment. Though the cause of club foot is unknown, some risk factors have been identified, including family history, with secondary causes, including genetic syndrome and neurologic conditions. In Ghana, where 928 babies are born with club foot, superstition and curses have been cited by some as the cause. These experts say lead to neglect of treatment, thereby ruining the lives of children. Uh, through this program, we aim to educate parents on how to recognize the signs of club foot uh, and uh, encourage them to seek medical attention if they suspect their child has the condition. If left untreated, the condition causes severe lifelong disability. Club foot can be treated successfully and the fortunate aspect is that the treatment is not too expensive. Right? If you put everything together, it ends up exceeding $400. That's for the en entire treatment fees. Whereas if you leave it and the child develops and becomes a neglected club foot, then it comes with a lot of what expenses and also socioeconomic implications become there. Not to forget about the psychological impact on the child. The Korea Foundation for International Healthcare Global Alumni, Ghana Chapter, has been creating awareness on club foot in Ghana. If a child is not able to stand, you obviously expect some delay in the developmental milestones. Because it's inexpensive and treatable, and it's caused a lot of trouble within society because there are myths and there are all sorts of ideas surrounding it. We wanted to bring it to the fore and make the public know that it's not a case, it is not a debilitating condition and that is a condition that can be treated so that the burden both on the family, the society and even the hospital and the individual is taken care of in the treatment. Dr. Ignatius Awimbuno is a director of Allied Health at the Ministry of Health. I therefore join the Kofi Global Alumni to call on all actors to support this program to prevent future disability in our communities. Stakeholders called on government to create an enabling environment for mothers of babies with clubfoot to access treatment. Yeah, I'm here, yeah, I'm here, 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 I